I'm sure you've seen them, those robot arms they use to build cars. Well, did you know those actually used to be people doing that? And it was dangerous work. Well, not anymore. Precisely controlled robots handle the dirty work in today's modern production facility. But they can't do it alone. An electronics technician is required to program and maintain them. It's a demanding job where you're responsible for millions of dollars of equipment. But with the right education, a two-year degree, or some advanced technical training, I'm sure you'll do great. Now go show those robots who's boss. It's like a video game with real sparks out here, right? We have to know where to put them. If we put them in the wrong place, then they're going to hit, they're going to crash, and that's going to create a big mess. So there's like over 250 of these robots that we get to go in and possibly fine tune all the time. We have inline measurement systems for the quality that we get to go in and do data collection with. Uh, we have AGVs, which is automatically guided vehicles. Whenever the machine's empty and needs parts, it tells it to go get more parts, and it does it all completely automatic. A typical day might be that we're coming in here and uh, fault occurs on the line. We have a big board that displays the whole line layout. If fault occurs, it will single out which area. So it comes up to a screen that we have, and this is a touch screen. And I can come through, I have fault screens. Let's say if a fault shows up, some sort, we can touch on the button for the fault, and we can see going through the logic itself on what the final root cause is of the problem. It's a real good feeling to be able to handle this multi-million dollar equipment that they give me the capabilities of doing what needs to be done to make it run efficiently.